Watching Super Bowl Sunday has been the tradition for many football fans throughout the years, but this year, the date of the Super Bowl could be in jeopardy due to a major snowstorm that's supposed to hit MetLife Stadium in New York. Here in Colorado, we may have to settle for watching the Broncos as early as Saturday or as late as Monday afternoon due to the potential dangers that the snowstorm could cause. Here at CSU, we've been experiencing drastic changes in our weather, but students living in Colorado have been used to the sudden changes in temperatures and conditions throughout the year. However, this weather is not just affecting our state, but everyone across the U.S. With the Super Bowl date creeping up on NFL officials, there have been rumors of changing the date of the Super Bowl due to a potential snowstorm that could affect all of the ticket holders to the game, and more importantly, the players. This snowstorm is predicted to hit MetLife Stadium hard, meaning that roads to the stadium could be blocked off, presenting people from getting to the stadium. Officials are saying the time of the game could be moved anywhere from a few hours off of tea time, moved a day forward, or a day earlier. The decision of when this game is played affects the entire state of New York, including hotels, attractions, and not to mention the people who plan on having parties at home while watching the game on TV. I was able to ask students here at CSU what their plans are for the game and how changing the Super Bowl date would affect their plans. Uh, the Super Bowl, I work at Bruce's Bar in Severin, so I have to work Sunday, and so I'll be there for most of it, and there's a big screen TV, so everybody's just going to kind of hang out there and um, do that, so that'll be pretty fun for everybody else besides me. Uh, I think the plan is probably just to move the party over to Saturday. Um, it doesn't really affect us that much because we're not going anywhere. Um, everyone's just going to come over, so I think moving it one day wouldn't really affect us that much. The final decision will be made in the NFL headquarters office by Randall Goodall. NFL headquarters will be discussing the potential for moving up the game 48 hours before the event. From there, they will watch the weather and come up with a time that will be safe for all players and people attending the game. Make sure to tweet us at Collegian Central your game plans for the Super Bowl and how the change of time could be affecting your viewing of the game. Wishing best of luck to Peyton Manning this weekend and go Broncos.